Hello and welcome to Digital Frontier, a weekly look at the latest developments in crypto, NFTs, blockchain, and AI. I'm your host, Melody Tissera. Let's get started with the headlines. Bitcoin rally continues, breaks through a two-month downtrend. Deutsche Bank applies to operate as a crypto custodian. AI to benefit neurological disease treatments like Alzheimer's. Bitcoin, the world's leading cryptocurrency, experienced a significant rally, breaking through a two-month downtrend and the 50-day simple moving average. It suggests a continued rally towards 30,400 US dollars. This breakout has been fueled by potential inflow of money, multiple spot Bitcoin ETF applications and increased attention. Deutsche Bank to operate as a crypto custodian in Germany. This showcases the bank's further entry into the crypto space. This aims to offer institutional grade storage solutions along with a range of services such as buying and selling digital assets, taxation, valuation, fund administration, lending, staking and voting. MasterCard, a global payment giant, filled a patent application revealing its plans to develop software optimized for Bitcoin and blockchain transactions. The company aims to streamline crypto-based transactions by reducing connections between virtual assets service providers. This includes the creation of downloadable API software that facilitates transaction verification with blockchain networks simplifying cryptocurrency handling and trading. Moving on to the world of NFTs, HSBC, a British banking institution, has filled trademark applications related to the metaverse and non-fungible tokens. This signals the interest in virtual banking services and online marketplace for NFTs. HSBC joins other industry giants such as JP Morgan, Visa, PayPal, and Western Union in exploring opportunities within the metaverse. In entertainment, Nike teased the launch of NFT sneakers on the popular game Fortnite. This potentially introduces Web 3.0 adoption to a massive player base. In AI news, Palantir, a leading big data analytics, demonstrated its AI platform for military use. This shows how AI can be applied to national defense and other military purposes, focusing on ethical principles to guide its usage in sensitive and classified contexts. Researchers have developed an AI-based technique for measuring fluid inflow around the brain blood vessels. This technique has significant implications for developing treatment for neurological conditions like Alzheimer's. And lastly, EPFL School of Engineering has developed an original like robot inspired by polygon meshing and swan behavior. This modular robot can engage shape move and interact with objects and people. Its adaptability to different environments and tasks positions it as a potential asset in space exploration. And with that, we wrap up for this week. Subscribe to our YouTube channel at the link below for more updates on crypto, NFTs, blockchain, and AI. Until we see you again next week. Thank you for watching. Stay safe.